the wall. Kid, come with me. I gotta find some work. code you wouldn't know. I have an idea. Gun one, try 6682. You sure? Hurry! It worked! But how'd you know? That was the code of the first bomb. Your birthday. First bomb? My... my birthday? Your mom and dad, Alex. Naomi and Steven. They built it and used the most important day of their lives as the code. We were gonna use it, but there was a problem at the last moment. That's when Connie and I tried to take Tyrak out of the truck. We worked too hard to come up empty-handed, but we missed, and Tyrak detonated the explosives on the peak. And my parents were killed. Yes. And Connie. And so many others that day. Why didn't you tell me this sooner, John? I thought it'd radicalize you. Push you to build the bomb. And... I... didn't want you to hate me. Hate you? If I had killed Tyrak, your parents would still be alive. They made their choices, Mr. Yu. They put themselves in that position. That's not on you. Thanks for saying that, kid. Now come on, let's... Uh, well. Don't move! Hands up and turn around. Slowly. Hands up, I said! Mom, don't shoot! Alex? Your mom's a cop? Get out of here, Alex. That voice. Wait, Papa Bear? No! You know each other? Yeah. Turns out I've been chatting on the CB with the very person I was after. Well, it's not great for me either. The woman I love being a cop and everything. <laughs> love. Yeah. Love. Ha! <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Listen, I'm sorry I stood you up. I chickened out. You think I care about that now? My mom and Mr. Ursus were gonna go on a date? My mind is gonna explode. I told you, get out of here! Listen to your mom. So, how do you know each other again? I did some work for the brigades, for info on my bio parents. John knew them. Yeah, right. It's the truth. My girlfriend and I were friends with Alex's parents. Your girlfriend? She died in 86. I've been trying to protect Alex. You gotta believe me. It's true, Mom. John wasn't using me. He was trying to protect me. Look, I screwed up. I became a part of something that turned bad. Not a day goes by that I don't regret it. But I'm a different person now. I want to be with you. I'm a cop, and you're a wanted criminal. Forgive me, but I don't see how that could work. Mom, look around. Things are happening. Change is happening. Give John another chance. He screwed up, but we all make mistakes. You, for instance. Me? Yeah, I mean, come on, Mom. You know what Tyrek is doing to teens. I... I do. Yes. You really want to keep working for a government that does that? No. I haven't wanted to do my job for a long time now. But I did it. For you. Well, you no longer have to, Mom. Now, please. We can 
cross together. There's nothing keeping us here. We can leave. Mom, what do you think? Kid, you can come if you want. Supporters on the other side of the wall have broken through and are now fighting the border forces with the brigades. Could this be it? Is the revolution really happening? <laughs> Be a good time to go, sir. Kid, stop! Zoe! Fire at will. The uprising that started that day spread to most of Petria, ensuring a fair, democratic election. Floris won by a landslide and promised to repeal much of what Tyrak had done. Tyrak was arrested and tried for his crimes. The iron pits were closed and the wall came down as well. Though it's far too early to tell what the future of my country holds, for the first time in many years, there is hope. And that, at the very least, is a good place to start.